No, we were hoping no. That, we were hoping that one Rickard. That's his name. That's his name. Is Rickard? His name is Rickard. <laughs> yeah. That's me if my name was Rick. Remember we talked to a weirdo that was like, please help us with Rickard. Yeah, but isn't that just meaning like kill Rickard for us? Yeah, but I thought evil? I thought you had to do something before you fought him. Uh, wait, what do we name him? Um, um, it's been so long. So e Norma we... Scock. Yeah. <laughs> Did I tell you I used that name on a trivia at a bar? So, like, you could do the trivia on your phone and your name would pop up on the screen. Oh, you did that? And I named myself E. Norma Scott. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Thanks. So. Like these weird, um... Well, what's this? Snail creatures. Didn't expect strong foe. Be wary of up. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right. Be wary of up. Man, these things are just on the ceiling here. Yeah, we could just. So, uh, where, where do we go to get back? I'm. I think I'm going back. Okay. Okay, yeah, I huh. think. Whoa. This guy's dead. Pillage the remains. Depraved perfumer Carmen. Can you open that door that you see by? I can. Oh. Wait. No. That's okay. odd. So, we have to go back. You probably ran past the door or something. I probably did. Okay, let's look around. We're looking for a letter. A letter to us. We just got a letter. <laughs> How could it get better? What is in the letter? Uh-oh, it's CP. All of a sudden, <laughs> cops around them. <laughs> Do you think someone's ever planted CP in someone's house just to get them in trouble? No, I didn't do that. I, yeah, no, I'm sure someone did that. <laughs> I'm sure somebody... Someone, some point, someone did somewhere did that. Is this the letter? No, okay. I think that's just a message. You just destroyed a, his, sorry about that. a historical piece of furniture. Sorry, you sorry. absolute human filth. Wait, what's this? Read message. Try... F <laughs> nice. So, wait, let's go back to the people. Because then we can figure out where it is from there. Okay. Who's this guy? I don't know. Let's pick up the item. Recessant finger. Letter nice. From Volcano Man. And who's this dude? Let's talk to this guy. He looks nice. You. What in heaven's name are you doing here? The Volcano Manor is a pit of recusants who spit at grace and hunt our own kind. I hope you understand the weight of my words. Well, as long as you understand what you're saying. I thought you were tarnished bred by virtue. Perhaps playing that part led you to your doubts, I wonder. But know that the path you walk is blasphemy and leads only to a miserable death. Before you consider hunting any of your own kind, think on that. Well, why are you here? <laughs> this blasphemous path leads only to a pitiful death. Before you consider hunting any of your own kind, think on that. And I like how this guy is here, sitting right by the incriminating letter. What are you doing here? <laughs> like, I don't know, what are you what doing What are you doing? Oh, hey, it's this lady that needs a back support. Oh, I like this lady. Hello again, brave tarnished. As a scout, I am pleased to see you again here, at the Volcano Manor, under Lady Tanith's guidance. May you tread the path of valor. Brave tarnished under Lady Tanith. Okay. Thanks. So let's read. Wait, what is this? Oh, that must also be to this area. Duh. <laughs> wow. What was I thinking? Cool. All right. Are we going to read the letter? Inventory. Then we've got uh, key items. And now we're going to look for a letter. Well, these are... No, wait, these are just keys. I thought it would be here, though. Well, there is a letter right there. On the left. Irina's letter. No. So I would think that the other letter would be here. These are all cookbooks, cookbook, cookbooks. Huh. So it's not here. Ah. Uh... 
This is a bit of a problem I have with this game. Maybe it's in a different thing. Is I never know where to find anything. Uh, None of those. It's not a weapon. This might be a problem here. Yeah, this wait, wait, looks wait, like wait, it. What are these? What are these? Letter Letter? There we go. There we go. Right. Examine using square. Okay. Old Knight Istvan. He can be found in Limgrave. Find the red mark on your map. Okay, well, let's do that one. Okay. And so w we should be doing this. We're not going to get in trouble for this. No. No, this is part of the Volcano Manor quest line. Okay, good. And it's in Limgrave. Well, I didn't want, you know, this like these people being angry at me or something. No. Uh, Limgrave. That's so I think you probably started. have to go to the Warmaster Shack. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. So, is this... Well, the warm he's nowhere near the warm oh yeah, I guess he is. So I think Never you could probably take the path. I'll take the path. I will do that. Would you like a movie that's like Spider Man No Way Home, but it's like Batman, and we get to see all of the live action Batman minus Adam West, because he's dead. So like no. George Clooney would come back, Val Kilmer and he would lose weight. Michael Keaton as Batman, Christian Bale. No, I don't think Val Kilmer should be expected to lose weight for this role. I think he should. I don't. Why? You want him to be fat? I want him to gain weight for the role. Okay. <laughs> I want them to, like, really sabotage his life. Eat more, Val! Eat! <laughs> do you think, do, going do on you think this would be a cool thing, though? It would be cool, but I can't wait to hear everyone argue about, like, well, he was the best Batman because of it. Right. <laughs> so... I oh, don't know, that would annoy me. But other than that, yeah, I'm sure it'd be a cool idea. See, because I think that would be really cool. Because I think that's the only other thing besides Superman that really has multiple live-action characters that you can bring into a, a movie. And you can't do Superman either, because Christopher Reeves has they passed. So. Right, so there's only Henry Cavill and um, Tom Welling. And then there's Brandon Routh, and oh, then yeah, there's him. Tyler Hecklin. So you have three you can bring you in. four. Well, minus Christopher Reeves. No, you have four, even minus Christopher Reeves, because Tyler Hecklin is the one from Superman and Lois. Oh, got it. And then bring in Dean Cain. Which one's that? He's the one from, like, Lois and Clark, the show, who is, like, ultra-Republican, I guess, and everyone oh, hates. Oh, my favorite. <laughs> He's, I think, I is that think, it? uh... Yeah, this is, this is it. Old Knight Istvan, I'm sorry, man. Wait, where are we transferring to? Storm Hill. Huh, okay, there's Old Knight Esteban, Julio Ricardez, whatever his name is. I'm sweet out of Zach and Cody. Oh, I don't, uh, watch racism shows or whatever. How is that a racist show? <laughs> well, you call him, like, Julio whatever. That's his name, like, he has, like, 25 names. Wanna do it? Oh, okay, no. I don't think we have time for that no, one. No, this Esteban's, like, too... We have time for this, though. That spawns like way oh. too. Oh, and he used like a. Oh, and he just healed. Okay. Can you just like hit him? Fine. I, I was just trying to do. Oh, I was trying to do our mage class, but I guess I'll just hit him. Well, I'm trying to have fun. <clears throat> okay. Can we fish for backstabs? We don't even need to. Oh. He's not hard to beat. I just wanted to use my weapons. Okay. You sound like a Republican. Weapons are part of my religion. Also sound like a Republican. <laughs> hey! Nice. nice! We beat Esteban, so I think now we have to go back to the Volcano Manor. There was no story with that guy, was there? No. You see that over there? Can we talk to him? No, because we got pushed okay. out. So now we're going to go back there and we're going to talk to them again and see what happens. So did we get a scaled armored set? Oh, uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, nice. Are we just looking everything up at this point? Honestly, there's way too many NPCs. I'm not afraid to admit this. I'm looking it up. Yeah, I mean, if you want to just tell me where to go for the quests, that helps me. Yeah, there is way too many NPC quest lines, and it's way too confusing. Let's, I'm just looking them up. Let's, uh... But you can't wear it? Why? Because I clicked the wrong thing. Oh. Uh, let's see. Scaled... Oh, it seems like it's better. What does it say? Armor worn by Old Knight Istvan. The corroded metal is reinforced with rock hard scales, making it highly effective against non-physical attacks. Huh. Istvan is one of a few wizened, tarnished 
to who survived to this day. Okay. Well, not now. This is worse. I'm just going to wear the plate. I think the plate's kind of cool, though. It is cool. I think that's neat. I'm just going to wear that. And then I'm going to put on... Uh, put the full armor of God? No. I don't want that. Okay. I was just going to put on... Some, see if anything was better than the greaves I'm wearing. But it doesn't it look like, like they are. It's not. No. Okay, well, let's just go with that. All let's right. go talk to these... My boys back at the Lava Manor. Hey, yo, what up, my boys? How you doing, Tanith, Raya, and Rescusant Bernal? That was really racist. Why? Because you You're said, the one who called Esteban, said, like, like Esto whatever, ethnic whatever. That's what you said. You said Esteban Julio Ricardo something. I don't remember what his Julio name Julio what? Ricardo. Okay, we use the word learning disabled now. <laughs> what? Learning impaired. <laughs> Should I talk to these people then? Yeah. Let's talk to them. Hey, yo, what up? Did you read the letter left for you? Yeah, I killed that, that guy. The task the Volcano Manor desires you enact. You will be compensated once the deed is done. Good luck. If you are loath to hunt your own kin, so be it. But you must leave this house at once. This is a war against the Erd Tree. We have no place for the meek, nor the luxury of keeping clean hands. You've completed your task. I am pleased. Now you are a recusant true, and a full-fledged member of the Volcano Manor. This is your reward, as promised. Magma shit. <laughs> Yay! Nice! Never forget that the recusant fights to tread the path of the champion. The way is tainted, but for this very reason, it is the true path to valor. Now you are a recusant true. I am pleased to have you. Very cool. I'm just saying, she's kind of thick. She's not T doing too bad. H I double C. I need an F R E A K. <laughs> okay, so his full name is Esteban Julio Ricardo Montoya de la Rosa Ramirez. That was racist. That's his name. Yeah, they wrote that racistly. No, he, he is... Isn't this the sweet life on dick? No, it's oh, oh, the sorry, sweet sorry. life on Zach and Cody. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I don't think I No, watched... you're, you're talking about my life. <laughs> I watched the wrong show. Ooh, letter from Volcano Man. Nice. What does this guy have to say? Are you still mad, bro? So... You've blooded your sword in the hunt. Then I shall introduce myself once more. Banal. A recusant just like you. Recusants have particular battle arts, styled to our methods of slaughter. Why not add some to your repertoire? Oh, nice. We can learn skills. Do you need to get all these for an achievement? I don't know. Might as well just buy them over here. Yep. Alright. Okay. You've come to understand now, eh? To take power and make it his own, the recusant must hunt his own kind. To raise the flag of revolt against this sanctified pillaging, we recusants must become the most wretched of predators. All you can do is laugh. Well, until we meet again. Oh, not had your fill, eh? Okay, let's read the letter. letter. Wait, wait, let's see what this girl has to say now. Have you ever heard any strange sounds here at the manor? Something beyond the walls, like breathing or slithering scales? Oh, fie, what am I saying? It just is impossible. I must be tired. Sometimes I hear strange sounds beyond the walls, like breathing or slithering scales. Oh, perhaps I'm just feeling... Look, you said she's not hot. Yeah. But here's my question. What position is she in right now? She's like a hunched over position. Right. And now you just hunch her a little more over, and it's like a normal chick. I see your point. During, you know what I mean? I see, so, your, I see your point. So, like, I don't understand what you're talking about, but <laughs> let's go over here. We got another letter from Volcano Mayor. What if it just said, like, what if it was just, like, 
kill yourself. <laughs> well, we gotta. Riley the Idol. He can be found in the Atlas Plateau. Find yeah. a red mark on your map. What makes that red mark red? Okay, that's racist. But no, it's not. I'm just wondering how they made the red mark. Isn't it up more? Well, I don't know. Was it right there? Where? Up there. Up. Oh, I didn't see that. Sorry. I was yeah. just busy. And then now go the last. Right there. The Bridge of Iniquity. That's like where you live. <laughs> Why? Feeling, Why is that where I live? Always feeling like unhappy <laughs> with yourself when compared to me. That's true. Just constantly measuring. All right. Let's, oh wait, is he down there? Oh wait, wait. Maybe we have to get down there. It says the quickest way to reach the summon sign is via the old Altus Tunnel site of Grace. Is that that one? It might be. I think there's a site of Grace that we haven't gotten yet. Great. Okay. Oh boy. All right. So let's. Uh... All right. Well, I have an idea. Wait, 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 go to the left. Up. What's that one? Oh, Windham Catacombs? Windham? <laughs> okay. I clicked that and that was like too hard for the recorder. <laughs> what makes the Windham windy? Or... Hey, get that uh, thing over there. Oh, okay. The, I had to ride By there. the turd tree. Nice, we got a golden seed. I find it really funny that other people beat this game months ago, but because we only play it for like a couple hours a week, maybe, it just takes us forever. Yeah. Do you find that funny? I do find it funny. I feel like we're going to be playing this game for like a year, and everyone's going to be like 10 years past this game. And not care. Yeah. I mean, I still think it's fun. Yeah. I mean, the problem is when you don't have... This sounds mean to people who did beat it, so I'm not trying to be, but when you don't have unlimited time to game, right? games like this can take a long time. Mm -hmm. I don't really play it without you except for when I leveled up. Right. I don't really go around and explore and stuff because I thought we were trying to do that in our Let's Play. Yeah. And find stuff. And speaking of which, if I find any caves, I would like to go in them because it's actually fun. Mm -hmm. uh, but, I don't know, I mean, you know, it just kind of hits a point where these games are... Oh my Whoa, what is this? I don't know, the Headless Horseman or something? Huh. What was that? I think that was like just a regular enemy. <gasps> oh, oh no! Oh jeez. What's this? This might be that cave that we were looking for. Examine? Yes. Use stone Sword Key? Okay. Oh no, oh no, no, <laughs> right. oh, no! Use the key, use oh, the no, key! Oh no, oh <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my. Let's just do this. <laughs> Sorry, bucko. You've gone to your last rodeo. I don't know. Okay. Was that a good insult? That was like a white man insult. <laughs> wow. Listen here, bucko. <laughs> <laughs> your dad's insult would just be briskly walking past him on the streets of Minneapolis. What? Because he walks so fast? What do you mean, what? Are you what? stupid? What are you talking about? Are you about? stupid? Dumb? Or dumb? Huh? Dumb, stupid, or you want my gum, huh? <laughs> but yeah, my main problem with this game, though, is I feel like the game was really fun when it first came out. Oh, you're not having fun and anymore? It's okay. You but really? I, you're not having hold fun? Hold on. I think it was like amazing when it first came out because everyone was into the game. And everyone was playing it, like, at unlimited speeds. Right. But me and you wanted to let's play the game, and the game is so ginormously huge that now we're at the point where everyone's already moved on from the game, so you don't get the hype around it. And we're still, like, stuck on the game. And we only play it, like, it feels like once a month. So it's like every time we play it, we're always, like, stuck in some NPC quests that take forever. And it really feels like we don't advance anything because we play it so infrequently. See, I, I understand, but I don't think hype matters. Because, no. Like, you know, I I went back and played... Well, I, I was saying hype for the people watching the Let's Play is what I was meaning. Okay, and I was talking about just for us. Like, right. I don't, I don't think that matters much for us because... Is that the tunnel we're supposed to go to? Yeah. Well, let's, let's clear the tunnel, then we'll keep going. The reason I don't think it matters for us, though, to enjoy it is because, like, we never bought into the hype anyway. We just hoped the game was good. Right. Like, I don't think either of us was like, Oh my gosh, Elden Ring, it's gonna be the best ever! I think we were just like, oh, we really like Dark Souls. 
I hope this is good. Right. And it is good. It's just that it's so big. Yeah, that it's right. hard to get through. Well, and that and that's what my problem is is games that are so incredibly huge for me at least. This is going to sound like I'm lazy or something, but it it's hard for me to get into games that are so incredibly ginormous. Because at some point, I would like to play something else. Well, I understand that, but you... I feel like it depends on what the game is It does, it does. If this was Assassin's Creed Origins, I feel like you'd have an easier oh, time. Oh, sure. Yeah, because I'm really more into that. But And one game I am excited to get into is Skyrim. I love Because I, so like, I feel like I would get into that game. Whereas with Elden Ring, it's like the game is so ridiculously huge. And I'm an expert on that. And so you're ridiculously huge. And to be honest with you, I don't hate the game. I don't dislike the game. I just think the game is fine. Is it your least favorite it Souls is, game? It is my least favorite Souls game. Um, every other Souls game that i played, which has been 1, 2, and Demon Souls, so I guess only 3 out of the 5, all three of the other Souls games I've been really into. Like, I've really loved the game. Mm -hmm. This game, I feel like, is a lot harder for me to get into. Like, I, more often than not, I find myself kind of zoning out. Well, I do think there's something to be said about the fact that it is uh, less focused. Do you want to play some, by the way? Sure. That might help you enjoy it a little more, instead of just me playing. Do you remember the controls? Uh, we'll have to figure them out here. Okay. 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 R1. There you go. And you have to I have to figure the controls out. What you is have to switch to the <laughs> to the shield with that left arrow. Okay. <laughs> I was just playing Kingdom Hearts. There you go. Okay. Luckily these guys are much lower level than we are. Good job. Back up, back up, back up! Heal, square. I know. Okay, I didn't know if you knew the controls, sorry. I'm sorry. No, I just I was just trying to tell you. Alright, okay, well... I'm having a problem here. Are you okay? No. Everything alright? Alright, you're not zoning out now. Ooh, that was my boss battle. <laughs> Basically.